Hi book club. I'm sorry once again that I can't be with you, but I have a report about the beach book I read. It is called What I Had Before I Had You by Sarah Cornwell. That's what the cover looks like. This book was recommended by my best friend because we both grew up in New Jersey and we frequently visited the Jersey Shore which is the setting for this book. I did not like this book. You probably know that I like most of the books that I read for book club, but I really did not like this book. It had a really preposterous plot. It's set in the present over a seven hour period uh, with a large part of it told in flashbacks. It's about um, Olivia is the main character, and after her divorce, she is returning with her two children to the town on the Jersey Shore where she grew up. I believe it's a fictional town because I had never heard of it. Uh, Ocean Vista, I think it's called. And the major plot point in the present part of the story is that suddenly her bipolar eight-year-old son disappears. But the author doesn't really spend very much time having Olivia look for her, her bipolar son. Most of the book is really uh, spent in this flashback portion. And in the flashback plot, Olivia's mother is a psychic who gives birth to twin girls who die in infancy. But preposterously, the mother continues to act as though the twins are alive and maintains their nursery and buys baby food for them. And it's just really, really stupid. Uh, years later, as a teenager, Olivia sees a pair of twin girls on the beach who are about the age that her, she feels that her sisters would have been, and she decides that they are actually her uh, sisters, the twins. But it turns out that there's another set of twin girls because Olivia's father has had an affair with Olivia's sister. And since I really don't recommend that anyone read this stupid book, I'll go ahead and tell you that the missing bipolar son does finally show up. So that's my report. Really cannot recommend the book. Hope you have a great meeting. <clears throat>